Hello, my name is Charlotte and I'm very passionate about going green. In this documentary, I'll be exploring some ways we can reuse products and reduce waste. Currently, humankind produces 2 billion tonnes of waste per year. Sadly, if we don't act now, the World Bank has predicted a 70% rise in waste production by 2050. In a recent survey that I have conducted, I found a lot of people using popular products that would be thrown away shortly after use. 50% of people who completed my survey said they had thrown away at least one surgical mask a week. In addition to this, 47% of people who had completed this survey said they had thrown beauty removal products away at least once a week. According to the Environmental Journal, 94 million face masks are being thrown away weekly. It is also estimated that these face masks will take 450 years to fully decompose. After learning this information, I think it is crucial to share a great alternative to the surgical mask. This is my classmate Alistair. He's agreed to meet with me today to discuss his experience using reusable face masks. So Ali, when did you start wearing reusable masks? Uh, I'd probably say maybe August, September time, I think. In August, they sort of had, had it mandatory in sort of supermarkets and stuff. And then I think with college coming back, I need to, I don't think it was viable to, to have non-reusable masks. So when I went into to college every day. Have you seen any surgical slash non-reusable mask litters? And can you give me any examples of when you've seen these? Um, I've seen a lot of them, to be fair. I think the main sort of place I see them is usually outside shops or like mainly like sort of town centres. How do you recommend using a reusable mask? Is it comfortable? Would you, which ones would you recommend? I'd say the ones I bought are pretty are, are fine in terms of the face and stuff, but I think the only uncomfortable part is around the back of the ears, it sort of digs in. Mm. But I think that might just be the fabric that they use. But. So Ali, would you recommend using reusable masks? Uh, yeah, I think more, obviously I think it helps with the environment and stuff, being able to not dump plastic into the oceans and into that sort of stuff. But I also think more from a, I guess, ease of access, maybe would be the word. After hearing Alistair's experience, it really shows how easy it is to use alternatives for everyday products. Another common household waste product are beauty removal wipes. According to Bustle, 20 million makeup wipes are being thrown away daily. This makes wipes the third most wasteful product globally. After learning this information, I got two of my sisters, Lucy and Christina, to try out some reusable makeup wipes. Today, they are here to share how it went. So, um, two weeks ago, I asked you both to collect up all your beauty removal products without throwing them away and store them into a bag. Um, so, how many does it seem you've used in one week? Um, I've used quite a lot, so I've probably got over 30 in here. Yeah, I didn't use as many, but just under 20, so use an average two a day. As you both have shown quite a substantial amount of um, beauty removal products that would be thrown away, do you think this has any negative impacts? Uh, yeah, it definitely has a negative impact on the environment and, you know, disposing of them probably isn't easy. Cost as well. I didn't expect there to be that many. So, over the last week, I've set you both with the task of using reusable um, beauty removal products uh, to see what, if this is a better choice for the environment. Um, could you tell me your experiences with these products? Uh, yeah, I was really impressed, actually. Initially, I thought they might not take my makeup off as well, um, but one side has more like an exfoliating side, so it just get all the makeup off that you need to. And then at the end of the week, you put them in this bag and just wash them in the washing machine, ready to use the week after. Uh, yeah, as well, I um, use a lot more than Christina did. Um, so I was surprised at how little I actually had to wash them. So after this week of using these reusable products, will you be going back to your old ways or will you be sticking with this alternative? I don't know about you, Lucy, but I'm going to carry on using them. Yeah, they fit into my routine, so they've been good.
Yeah, no, I'm definitely the same. It's better for the environment and, you know, you're using a lot of less waste and they're still convenient, so why not? After hearing both their experiences, it shows we can cut down on these products without it even being difficult. It is really crucial we all try to swap waste with reusable alternatives to create a greener planet. Together, we can reduce waste going to the streets, oceans and landfills. If we do this, we can help our earth breathe, save our animals and create a much greener planet for our future generations. Don't waste. Replace.